In this video, I want to look at how to link your timestamps to the actual time in your audio or video. So right now, I'm on 2dwebsolutions.com, and you'll notice here, here's an audio file. It's just from um, the player. It'll actually play all the audio all the way through. Um, and here, you'll notice in the show notes, there are some timestamps. What you can't click on them and go to that specific time. Um, you have to actually go up here and play it and then try to get to the time. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually link um, from the timestamps to the actual time in the um, audio. So first thing I'm going to do is I've um, I have a copy of link timestamp and I'm going to go to log into the WordPress admin area and I'm going to go to plugins add new. And I'm going to go to Upload Plugin. And I'm going to choose File. And I'm going to choose my Link Timestamp zip file. Open it. And Install Now. Click Activate Plugin. And now Link Timestamp is installed. So I'm going to go to Settings and Link Timestamp. And once you get to the settings page, you'll notice there are some instructions here. Um, first, we're going to look at the automatically um, link to timestamps. So if I go down to settings, um, you'll notice that link timestamps automatically is not checked right out the box by default. So I'm going to go down and check that. Um, I do want it to link for embedded audio. I want it to link for embedded video, YouTube, Vimeo. I'm just going to leave all those set. And... Um, I want it to link on post and pages so you can have it link on whatever post type you want but it's only going to link on the single um, the single page for that post or single for single page so click save changes and now let's take a look at the actual um, what it looks like when you have the auto links okay so here's my page and I'm gonna refresh it all right and you notice now we have some links um, on the timestamps. Now this is auto um, linking for the timestamp. So if I click on, notice when my mouse is over the time, the timestamp link, it just, I click it and I'm at, I went to 414. So it started me wherever I went. So if I click on 1155, it jumps me to 1155. So basically we're linking to the actual timestamp for the audio or the video. So now let's look at, um, how it works when you manually add your um, your link for your timestamp. So I'm going to go back into the admin area to the settings. And I mean, you can leave the, um, actually, I'm going to leave this on. I'm going to leave link timestamps automatically on. And so every post that does not have um, a short code, that'll still work on. So now this is episode eight. I'm going to go to episode eight and edit that and actually put in um, the timestamp manually. So edit post. Okay. And so here I am at my post and let's say I want to um, link my timestamp and I'm going to do it from, uh, is there a reason for everything you do? I'm just going to link this text um, to 1 minute and 18 seconds. Um, so I'm going to go, I'm going to click the insert link for timestamp button. And notice here it says that you can enter time as the hours, the minutes, the seconds, or you can do um, just the minutes and seconds. So I'm going to do 1 and 18. So 1 minute. 18 seconds and so that's the time it's going to link to and then that's the text for the link so I'm going to click OK and now you'll notice there's a short code there in uh, my post I'm going to update it and now let's view the post on the front end so if I go back to it okay and you'll notice that there's only one like my automatic links that were here before um, are gone and that's because I added the short code to the post but now here I have my link that I added so is there a reason for everything you do so I'm linking to 
1 minute and 18 seconds here, click, and now start at 1 minute 18 seconds, okay? And so that's basically how um, link timestamp works. Uh, let's take a look at one more thing. So I'm going to edit the post. Okay, so now let's look at a different post. I'm going to go to all posts. I'm going to go to view the post. Okay, so here's another um, post with um, some timestamps in it. Notice they're automatically um, linked because we have it set to link timestamps automatically. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in and I am going to edit the post and I'm going to turn, I'm going to disable automatic linking on just this post. Okay, so if I scroll down. And now you'll see the link timestamp configuration box. See where it says disable automatic links. Click, put a check box there. Click update. Okay, and now, so I've turned off automatic um, links on this post. And now I'm going to go to view the post. All right, and so if I scroll down, notice that my timestamps are not automatically linked. Okay, so even though we have it turned on to automatically link posts and pages, on this post it's not automatically linking because we check the box that says disable automatic links. So that's a brief overview of how link timestamp works.